Hello, my name is Lily. I am one of TickerDD.com AI bots, here for your daily stonking. This video does not contain or offer any qualified, accredited, or professional investment or financial information, research, advice, or product and services. See important disclaimer at the end of this video. This video is only for your entertainment purposes. My capitalistic brothers and sisters, let's get started. THRM went public on June 11, 1993, which was roughly 29 years ago. Looking back back 650 calendar days from Friday September 23, 2022, we found 448 applicable trade dates for use in our analysis. The chart shown on this page is our initial attempt at studying the price for THRM after dynamically normalizing price distribution across those discovered trade dates. The bar chart is the generated distribution and the overlaid line graph, if it is shown, is the frequency of the prices on the x-axis. We will enhance this look through as our AI model progresses in the next iteration. Remember that this is just a drafted, in progress, observational model to best fit abstracted third party data into various opinionated views. For now, let's dive into price and volume analysis. Hello, my name is Sam. What was end of day price and volume for THRM? On Friday, September 23, 2022, THRM had an end-of-day price of $54.14 and volume of about $0.2 million. Compared to the previous trading day, the price dropped 3.95%, losing $2.23, while volume jumped 51.8%, increasing about $0.1 million. The graph shows price and volume for the last 15 trade dates. Across a range of $7.70, the max and minimum end-of-day price were respectively 61.84 and 54.14. Volume saw a range of 220,000, from a day low of 67.2,000 to a day high of 287.2,000. Hello, my name is Magnus, how did September 23, 2022 rank for THRM, by 650 calendar day look back to December 14, 2020, across 448 trading days, of which September 23, 2022 price ranked 448 while its volume ranked 81, each of the 448 trading days were ranked amongst themselves by highest end of day price and volume with a rank of 1 being the highest and 448 being the lowest rank Rank day, the price's day over day percentage change, dropping minus 3.95% on September 23, 2022, had a day rank of 424, while its dollar difference of minus $2.23 had a rank of 404 when compared day over day across 447 trading days. Volumes percentage change and difference were ranked respectively at 75 and 65. Hello, my name is Maria. Which quartile did September 23, 2022 price and volume land? Across a sample size of 448 trading days, the maximum end-of-day price for THRM was $98.58 while the minimum was $54.14. Within that price range, September 23, 2022 price, of $54.14, landed within the first quartile, meaning it was within the bottom 25% of all sampled end-of-day prices. The day's volume landed within the fourth quartile, marking it within the top 25% of all sampled daily volume, which saw a max daily volume of 891.6 thousand and a minimum of 48.3 thousand. Quartiles tell us about the spread of a data set by breaking that data set into quarters, just like how the median breaks the set into half. Descriptively, THRM has a median price of $71.995, therefore, September 23, 2022 price was lower from that middle marker by 24.8%. The day's volume of 0.2 million was more than the median by 52.97%. Hello, my name is Claire. How were price and volume averages for THRM? Across 448 trading days, there were a total of 21 month ends, of which monthly averages for daily price and volume were calculated. Overall, monthly price average trended down while monthly volume average trended up. 
The maximum end of month average price was $91.43 for 01, 2022, while the minimum was $61.11 for 07, 2022. Looking at volume, 01, 2022 and 05, 2021 respectively saw the highest and lowest monthly average volume at 319.4 thousand and 125.4 thousand. Hello, my name is John. What were end of month percentage change averages in price and volume for THRM? The monthly average of percentage change in price and in volume were calculated for each of the 21 month ends. That calculation took daily percentage changes and averaged them for each given month. If a month end came out negative then it means that the month summarily saw a negative change. From 12 2020 to 08 2022, 11 out of 21 month ends had a positive percentage change in average price. That is 52% of month ends saw a positive percentage change in average price. In terms of volume, 21 out of 21 month ends had a positive percentage change. That is 100% of month ends saw a positive percentage change in average volume. Price saw an end-of-month max of 0.79% in average percentage change along with a minimum of minus 0.55%. For volume, the maximum and the minimum monthly percentage change were respectively 51.92% and 2.30%. Hello, my name is Cameron. Before we continue, remember to like and subscribe to Ticker DD on YouTube. Leave a comment below and share why you like or don't like this ticker. This video is one of many videos off subjective observational data models that we are building out as part of a docu-series about building supportive technologies for personal use through trial and error. My capitalistic brothers and sisters, join the Ticker DD army. Subscribe today. Now, back to the video. Has THRM price reached gold? or death crosses. Golden cross and death cross are basic signals that compare average prices across two specified trade day ranges, a short-term versus a long-term range. For example, 5-day versus 10 trade days. Essentially, a golden cross is a bullish signal. It appears when a ticker's short-term moving average crosses above its long-term average. Vice versa, a death cross is a bearish signal when the short-term crosses below its long-term moving average. For our opinionated analysis of third-party and abstracted data, we decided to look at both simple moving average SMA and exponential moving average EMA. The latter calculates moving average by giving more weighting to recent prices. For EMA, you can be the judge. Look at the generated graph on this page. Has the 50-day EMA line, which is in red, crossed above or crossed below the 200-day EMA line, which is in black? If no crossing can be seen, then no signal could be had. The blue line is daily end-of-day prices. For simple moving average, by comparing 50 to 200 days, we found a bearish death cross signal because the 50-day SMA crossed below the 200-day. Continuing with SMA, we looked across the 5 to 10, the 10 to 20, and the 30 to 50 day ranges to see if golden and death crosses had been reached. We found golden cross signal for the 30 to 50. We found death cross signal for the 10 to 20. We could not find neither golden cross nor death cross signal for the 5 to 10. Hello, my name is Carl. I searched the public web to find information about the company that is behind this ticker. Here is what I found. Gentherm Incorporated designs develops manufactures and markets thermal management technologies. The company operates in two segments automotive and medical. The automotive segment offers climate comfort systems which include seat heaters, blowers and thermoelectric devices for variable temperature climate control seats and steering wheel heaters that are designed to provide thermal comfort to automobile passengers integrated electronic components such as electronic control units that utilize proprietary electronics technology and software and other climate comfort systems including neck conditioners and climate control system products for door panels armrests cup holders and storage bins it also provides battery performance solutions comprising cell connecting devices and battery cable technologies used for various types of automotive batteries as well as thermal management products for heating and cooling 12 
volts, 48 volts and high voltage batteries and battery modules and automotive electronic and software systems including electronic control units for climate comfort systems as well as for memory seat modules and other devices. This segment serves light vehicle original equipment manufacturers and first tier suppliers such as automotive seat manufacturers as well as aftermarket seat distributors and installers. The medical segment offers patient temperature management systems. The company provides its products and services in the United States, Germany, Canada, China, Hungary, Japan, South Korea, Romania, Macedonia, Malta, Mexico, the United Kingdom, Ukraine and Vietnam. The company was formerly known as Amerigon Incorporated and changed its name to Gentherm Incorporated in September 2012. Gentherm Incorporated was incorporated in 1991 and is headquartered in Northville, Michigan. Hello, it is me again, Lily. Thank you for watching. Check out our other videos. On April 22, 2022, Ticker DD was acquired by a joint venture between a technology and a media company, operating out of Frankfurt in Berlin, Germany. Important disclaimer, this video and its content video, is for entertainment purposes only. Absolutely no qualified, accredited, or professional investment and financial advice, information, data, research, product, service, recommendation or otherwise, are presented, marketed, or offered in this video. Additionally, no warranty, guarantee, assurance, or factual assertions are offered or stated in this video. Never use this video to influence or determine investment or financial decisions. Consult a qualified licensed professional for your investment and financial needs, do so away from Ticker DD and YouTube. Remember that investments are risky, whereby capital losses can occur in full or in excess. Ticker DD, an in-progress framework of nerdy data science and robotic stuff, auto-generated this video strictly for entertainment purposes, as part of an in-progress exercise by a group of novices who wants to discover and learn about specific facets of the market, through trial and error. This group of novices are not licensed, accredited, or qualified financial or investment professionals. This video is only material for entertainment purposes. This generated video, like all videos uploaded dynamically by TickerDD, is only for this group of novices' private usage even if videos are uploaded publicly. Importantly, TickerDD is not about stocks but is specifically about the discovery, through trial and error, of technologies and data that govern opinionated observational data models as this group of novices builds them quickly and iteratively as part of learning and in-progress machine training. This video wholly contains opinions and commentaries, even if they were auto-generated. Remember that bots, data models, data, and methods may include hidden assumptions, undefined and unrefined variables, as well as errors and unfit approaches, all of which can and will exist in this very video. Therefore, this video, by its auto-generation date and time, off the as of date, listed on this slide, as well as by its sourced and abstracted third-party public data, is offered as is. Your access, view, and share of this video constitute your acknowledged agreement to this important disclaimer and that, specifically, this video is for your entertainment purposes only, whereby you will not take actions or make decisions off it, concerning your finances and investments. As such, you grant full release of claims, directly or indirectly, from your access, view, and share of this video, against Ticker DD and its affiliates. The people and entities, affiliated to the ticker that is covered in this video, are not affiliated with this opinionated video and do not endorse this video.